Wednesday, the Atlanta Hawks have three picks in the first round of the NBA draft. Numbers 8, 10, and 17. They also have three second round picks. Now, I know the Hawks are way down on the popularity list in this state, but I again urge you to pay attention to what happens for this team on Thursday night. They have a young core of talent that's already very good with Trey Young, John Collins, and Kevin Herter. Now, they have a chance to add one or two multiple pieces to this puzzle. Several years ago, when the Hawks won 60 games, no one around here seemed to care. They were the Hawks, and we know they could never get past LeBron James and the Cavaliers. That team did have a ceiling that was reached, and that's why the new ownership decided to tear it down and start over. Along the way, General Manager Travis Schlink has accumulated draft picks and cap space and a lot of leverage. This franchise is in the best shape it's been in in many years, and Schlink deserves credit. If all goes well for the Hawks on Thursday night, people around the country will start talking about what this team is really building. It is my hope that sports fans in their own state will also take notice. I believe that most basketball fans in Georgia and in, in this area are just NBA fans or fans of another team, likely a team that has stars like the Lakers or Celtics or Warriors, more than a fan of the Hawks. As a longtime Hawks fans, I hope others will now jump on the bandwagon once they see what this team is building. The Hawks seem likely to come away from Thursday's draft with a wing, a shooting guard, or a small forward. DeAndre Hunter from Virginia and Cam Rennish from Duke are my favorites, and I would have no problem with Texas Tech's Jared Culver being the pick either. Add one of those players to the existing core, and the Hawks will have one of the best groups of players in the NBA. And they may even be a team you would want to go see in Atlanta in person. It's been a long time since they've been a team like that, but if all goes well Thursday night, you might just be tempted. So pay attention to these Hawks. They put the organization in position to deserve our attention.